Hi everyone and welcome to another video. Right today we're going to look at this um, CH341A um, chip programmer. Um, don't know if you saw the um, short that I'd done, uh, the unboxing when I got it a couple of weeks ago. Um, but yeah, let's go through. <laughs> so we've got the, the uh, reader itself. Then we've got a, a 1.8 volt uh, chip adapter. We have a adapter in case you need to unsolder the BIOS chip um, from the board. We have another adapter for um, this. And then we have a, a board that you can solder the chip to so we're just going to move them out of the way and we've got this one so this goes in there um, now you can only put this in one way so, all right so now um, we insert this now that's going to go in this end away from the the rock now I don't know if you can see that but when you lock it it does it seems to ride up um, so I don't know why that is um, but it does but it, it doesn't affect the um, uh, connection so, right so we're going to just plug this into a USB cable and the board we've got today um, we're using one from another video I done um, it's a Lenovo B5050 board that I swapped out um, because the USB ports somehow stopped working so we're going to connect this up now the chip is there on this that's the BIOS chip um, and it can be a bit of a pain to actually get it on properly um, the connector has got uh, a red wire denoting that that is pin 1 the chip will have a little circle or indent by um, by pin one now there's two software um, programs you can use um, I've got both of them there it's the AS programmer there and also um, there's this one here the um, CH341A um, programmer now I like this for the um, the look of it because I've actually got a, a TL um, 866 um, plus at home that I use for um, flashing my Amiga ROMs um, and this looks a bit like it um, but the only thing wrong with this is with this chip um, this chip it on on this board it's a um, <coughs> it's a W25Q64FV um, and uh, that software hasn't got <coughs> that version in but this uh, AS programmer has um, I'm gonna have to look and see if I can move the database from this one into um, the other software this one here um, but yeah so let's crack on and connect it up right so as I said pin one and we know pin one is over here so uh, try and put that on 
All right. And then we're going to come up to here and go detect chip. Right, okay, so it hasn't detected. So we're just going to have to. Yeah. Right, okay, so. So we're going to choose the W25Q64FV and select. Then we're going to say um, read chip. Right, so it's now read the chip and it's successful. So as you can see here, the data. Um, if we scroll through. Uh, so that's all the data. Right, so that's that. So now you can um, you can save it, um, or you can uh, erase it, and and uh, or you can if you've got a, a file that you need because the BIOS is locked up or something, you can uh, reflash it. Right. So we've had a look at that's the AS programmer software. Uh, so now we're going to have a look at the um, the other software and we're going to come up here and go detect now as you can see this is saying that it's um, a W25Q64BV um, now if we go into the chip search sixty-four, there is only the BV software uh, or chip ID in here um, I don't know if that makes a difference I don't think it really does but it's always nice to have the correct chip in the database so um, we're now gonna uh, we've done the detect and we're gonna do a, a read on there
Alright, so as you can see again, it's successfully read it. Okay. Um, never had that come up before, but... As you can see, that is all fine. Alright. Okay, so I don't know why that is coming up. Um, possibly the software. Well, that is it. Um, it's um, pretty good. It's, it's uh, cheap um, and easy to use. Uh, I, if you want it to um, do this, um, then yeah it's definitely worth it as i said i haven't seen um any need to do any modification to this one um unlike the people are saying that you need to do on the on the internet so this was the um chc41a black edition uh chip reader programmer um Hope you've enjoyed this little video. Please click like and subscribe. Watch out for our others. Um, I've got a coffee uh, page now. So if you want to donate to that. It would be really appreciated. Um, yeah. Have a good week. Take care. Be good to each other. Bye.